Welcome to Around Phelps Health, where we give you a behind the scenes look at our healthcare system. I'm your host, Paige Heitman, and with me is Dr. Nathan Ratchford, Chief Medical Officer at Phelps Health Hospital. Today we are here in an endoscopy operating room talking about an important screening tool for colorectal cancer, colonoscopies. Did you know colorectal cancer is the third most common type of cancer, not counting skin cancer, and is the second most common cause of cancer deaths in men and women combined? That's right. The good news is that the death rate from colorectal cancer is dropping, thanks in large part to cancer screenings. The American Cancer Society recommends people age 45 and older who are at average risk get regular screenings for colorectal cancer. One type of colorectal cancer screening is a colonoscopy, a procedure used to look inside your colon and rectum with a colonoscope. This long, flexible tube, about the width of a finger, has a video camera on the end so your doctor can see if there's anything abnormal in your colon or rectum. Special instruments go through the colonoscope to take samples of any abnormalities or polyps, which can again be tested to see if they're cancerous or not. If you've had colorectal cancer before, colonoscopies can be used to look for any new tumors. Before colonoscopy, your colon and rectum must be empty and clean for the doctor to perform an examination. Make sure to follow your healthcare provider's instructions before your test. You will be given anesthesia or a sedative so you're comfortable during the procedure, which typically lasts 30 minutes or more, depending on how many polyps are removed. Colonoscopies are outpatient procedures, so you can go back home when the procedure is over. Colonoscopies are nothing to be scared of and are a valuable tool to help detect colon cancer early. For Around Phelps Health, I'm Paige Heitman. And I'm Dr. Nathan Ratchford. Thanks for watching.